We have had so much rain going on around the country over the past several days and actually going further into this week that this is the perfect time to talk about those very pretty setups that go along with it. Rainbows. Well, first off, of course, you need the sun and then you need you, your eyeballs, for instance. The viewer themselves actually has to be between the sun and the rain. That's very important. You actually don't have the rainbow happening in front of the sun. It also really needs to kind of be a little closer to sunrise or sunset. You get that perfect viewing angle that goes in along with it, and that's just right to be able to get the different colors coming off those raindrops. Now, the other part here is that the rainbow itself is going to appear opposite the sun. So you are not going to have it happening basically over here looking at the sunshine. It happens the other way. The larger the raindrops that you can get from this, the bigger sometimes or the more bands that you can get from a rainbow. It's very cool to see how they actually go about forming. And with all the rain that we've got this week all around the United States, you might just be able to see a rainbow or two near you.